right, this is uh, my review on Monster's Little Jams earbuds. So here is the uh, packaging for the Little Jams. Typical Monster packaging. Uh, I'm not going to go ahead and open it up, but it slides out and there's a magnet and all that good stuff. But this is not an unboxing video, this is a review. So the uh, earbuds by Monster Jams, they come with a uh, carrying pouch here. And it's got a whole bunch of different uh, earbuds and stuff in it. It's a, uh, it just pops open like so. You can stick your stuff in there. It's really nice. It's made out of a uh, cloth material, but it has like a, uh, like a rubber or a water resistant coating on it. So, you know, feels real good. I wish they wouldn't have put that saying on there. I think that uh, definitely takes away from the. Uh, case here but Jamon's pretty cool with that nah, not really digging the slogan and then the uh, red tag here the uh, logo for monster so getting into the headphones at the uh, very top here you can see that they are uh, all metal construction they have the monster logo on the backs red and blue red being right here blue being the left here <coughs> And these are the tips that I like. They uh, they're very round, have a little bit of a cone shape to them, but they these ones you know these ones just happen to fit in my ear, so it's really nice. Now Monster says that these are virtually indestructible. I'm not going to test it out, but I can definitely tell you uh, they feel a lot better than any other earbud I've ever had, and I've had quite a few. I don't know if you can hear that, but I mean they're pretty solid. Um, Monster says that they chose to make them out of all metal so that there's no resonating from uh, plastic which is pretty good and then if we go a little bit deeper in here and we see without the tip on there I don't know if this camera's going to focus or not but you can see that it's all metal even you know this part right here which is really good and nothing feels loose on it, it all feels very sturdy even the connector that connects here to the, uh, to the wire Going down the headphone a little bit, there is a slider that moves back and forth, and that's just for when you're tying up the headphones, kind of connects it a little bit better. And then we have the splitter, it says little jams on it, once again all metal. The headphones also come with a uh, clip, so I like to use the clip, I think it's nice that they threw it in there kind of takes the stress off the ears the cables aren't pulling on your uh, on your ears when they're in there I like it, you know my shirt there and then the uh, one of the most important parts is uh, the plug here, so it's standard 3.5 millimeter you know, fits in everything, I'm using it on uh, the new iPhone, that's uh, actually I'm recording this video right here and it's gold plated, so you have a really good connection um, so how I feel about the headphones overall is that they have great sound. Uh, I listen to all kinds of music, from uh, classical to rap, and everything's really good. Uh, the mids are good, the highs really peak, and they sound nice without getting, uh, uh, I don't know how to, I don't know how to put it, but chintzy on you. And then the basses, they're not, it's not, it's not super low bass, you know, it's not resonating, uh. But, I mean, if you listen to rap music, it, it, it sounds pretty good. It's not, uh, you're not going to get the same effect as an over-ear, but for being in your headphones, definitely sounds really, really good. Especially when you have, a, like, a bassy track, like, uh, I don't know, some Young Jeezy or something. So, overall, headphones are really good. Uh, Monster's website says they uh, retail for 89 or something like that. I picked them up for 79 at Best Buy. So, um, I really uh, had a problem with Monster products before when they came out with the uh, uh, the Beats by Dre tours, and uh, those were horrible, hurt my ears, and uh, one of the speakers blew out uh, within like the first hour that I had it. So, but uh, these ones, you know, I took a chance with them because they were only 79 bucks, and uh, they're really, really good headphones. Definitely recommend them. Do not get the uh, Beats by Dre Tours. Um, for the amount of money that you're going to spend on those, you can go ahead and get, like, two pairs of these and, I don't know, give one to your mom. Overall, Little Jams, 
It's a bye. 